Yo, what's up guys? Today's Easter Sunday and I'm gonna pull up to this really old school. So I went to kindergarten 8,000 years ago. I don't have a lot of time to hunt here. So we're just gonna, we're gonna start in these little tot lots and uh, see where we go from there. So I'll see y'all on the first target. Okay. Sweet. First target. Very unexpected for a school ground. Let's keep going. Yes, I do have the simplex with me today. You will be hearing beeps and squeaks and squeals. Okay. Let's do this old school. Old school one. Still has sand in it. Yeah, that's all original. <laughs> 22 foil. Yeah, you betcha. Look at these holy gloves for Easter Sunday. I did hunt this school before, but like way on the other side. High tone. Seventy four, seventy six. Oh, I see it right there. Hard to grab it with the gloves. It's a dime. First coin of the day. 2000 Y2K dime. Oh boy. I think I'm gonna do the one glove, the Mike Jackson one glove. Cause it's hard to get my hand through here with the glove. Penny? Oh yeah. There it is. Penny. I'm still getting my hands dirty through the holes. <laughs> I might just take the gloves off completely. Alright. Halfway to our cycle? You know it. Surface quarter, 90, 91, pinpoint. Oh yeah, there he goes. Eagle backer, all right. Story of our lives, we need a nickel for the cycle. I repeat, we need a nickel for the cycle. And a ring. Just cause. Yes, 78. There it is. Another dime. Let's get that nickel though. Seventy-seven. This one's probably like right on top. There it goes. Sweet. It's actually a really nice day today. It's like the first day it's been over 70 degrees. Shorts. Shorts and a sweatshirt. Just, we don't know what's gonna happen. Stay ready for everything. <laughs> 
28. I don't know, nickel, I hope. Oh. Flat piece of metal. There's more of it in there, but we'll let it uh, hang out in there. Keep your secrets. Forty-eight fifty. What is it? Pull tab? I forgot what the numbers are on the simplex, kind of. What? What is it? Oh. Oh, I think that was a little out of frame there, but it's a zipper pull. <laughs> That's what those numbers mean. Zipper pull. Fifty eight. Oh, old school pull tab. Why do I call these old school pull tabs? Because it says lift on it, it has instructions. It was cutting edge technology at the time. They had to tell you how to do it. But this person lifted it too hard. They lifted it right off the can. Woo! And I got the head rush, pull tab head rush. Yes. The pull tab head rush world tour 2023. Coming to a town near you. All right, we're gonna go, I'm going high tones only. <laughs> High tones only as I proceed to investigate this solid mid-tone. 50, it's like 51, 54. Oh. Behold the glory that is of Coca-Cola. That's probably old. We'll call it a relic. Probably from like the late 1900s. Let's check out this jumpy run right next to the deer poo. I think it's gonna be a bottle cap. Not a bottle cap. Tarp ring or banner ring or whatever. Sign or tarp. Something, some kind of ring. Not the ring we want though. We'll take it. Thirty-one. Uh it's another tarp ring. Ha! Dang it. This one came with a head rush though. Whew. That's a serious head rush. If you ever just see me passed out in a field one day, that's what happened. Pull tab head rush. Wait a sec. <laughs> That's a ring. <laughs> that's a kid's costume ring, but that's a ring. It's got little stones in it. What? Yeah. Right on top, not even buried. That's funny. What did it come up as? Four? 54. 63. <laughs> Let me swing over it and see again. Everywhere from 41 to 58. And that's what we call a solid target. 
on the simplex. Dude, sweet. It's missing a couple of the little stones, but hey, that's a ring. Got a ring on the hunt. That's ring number 21 of the year. Sweet. Now we're talking. Now we just need that nickel. Found a ring before we found the nickel. I mean, there is like a trillion targets here though. So I guess that's the upside. We ain't running out of targets in this town. There we go. Seventy-five, seventy-nine. I guess dime. There it is. Jeez, when we wanted by the plug police for that one. Oh, it's a wheat scent. Oh, sweet, sweet wheat. Don't rub it. What's the year? 1944, <laughs> war penny, yeah, one cent, read it and wheat, ha ha ha, yeah, that's cool, I like that, that's some old, some old ting, one is in the 20s and 30s. Oh, man. Went to China for two, two rings on a triangle. Sweet, dude. I guess I could make like a wind chime or something out of it. I need that nickel. I, I will accept the nickel now. I am ready. I'm ready for the nickel. <laughs> Let's check the battery. 69%. Nice. So mid fifties. What is it? Penny? Maybe. I'm gonna have to go with zinc on that one, the way it's bubbling up like that. And the way it rang in as like a totally new number that's not previously known to mankind. Direct sunlight is warm. I'm digging this because it's a nickel noise. That's funny, I spent the last five months complaining about rain and like the first hot day, I'm like, oh, it's too hot. <laughs> oh yeah. Nickel noises indeed. We got our cycle. What year is this? 1970-something, 70, 70 or 79, or 76. One of the three. Penny noises? Penny noises aren't always pennies. Let's see. This time it was a penny. In 1999. Are we gonna party like it's that year? No, we're not. Surface dime. 
semi-surface dime. Shallow dime? It's like an outdoor teaching area, I guess. Yeah, that's Foil City right here, though. That's a little bit creepy. Imposter. It says go poop. A book that says go poop. <laughs> yes. Wow. That's a good one. It fell right into the fork of that other tree. Nice one. Nice. That's a big old pine, man. Smells great. Smells really good. All crunched up. Ninety one. There we go. 1980 quarter in the 1980s play set. Sweet. Actually, it's probably pre 80s. Yeah, I think we're going for high tones only. Because I got about maybe 30, 40 minutes left to hunt. Straight 30. Sweet. Nickel. Huh. No idea what, what's up with this one. It's like totally blank. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know about that one. Sounds like a nickel. It might not be a nickel. Hmm. All right. Oh, I think it is. Yeah. I can see his head on it. Weird. It's like mostly a 60. Ooh, big ting. Nice bullet casing there. Looks like a lawnmower hit it. Can't really see the writing, but there's writing. All right. What a huge tree that went down. This one looks a little older though. I mean, it's definitely, definitely went down a while ago. Man, that's a big one. That is a big one. Got the miner's lettuce going on. These round ones right here. You can eat those. Don't let the government find out though. Tons of it here though. The amount of like leftover jackets at this school is crazy. There's so many jackets here. And look at all the sweatshirts here. All right, just wanna see if I could get one last little high tone up out of here before we head out because uh, it's about time for me to go home and go to dinner, Easter dinner, prime rib, baby. Okay, that's high enough for me. 70, 71. Oh, oh never mind. 
Never mind. It's huge. See? Yeah. Let's shut her down. Actually, you know what? Since I have to walk through the woods back to my car, I might as well swing it through the woods, right? See if we get anything. Oh, 95 high tone right there. Is it huge? No. <laughs> First target on this path. I hope it's something good. It's probably not though. Oh, I think it's something huge. <laughs> it's a big old piece of metal. It's like a huge piece of aluminum or something. That sounded super good. I was thinking finally, finally get our silver coin. Nope. <laughs> uh -uh. Yeah, there are like no tones in this woods here it's quiet as a bone quiet as a bone yeah i guess that makes sense bones are pretty quiet i would argue that bones are even quieter than mice quieter than a mouse but are you as quiet as a bone hmm what is he talking about i don't know he's delirious he needs food yep here we go Swing it right to the car. Oh. All right, we got a 79 right at the bumper here. <laughs> Final target. All right, final target of the day is a dime. All right, we're making history. We go straight from the ground to the wrap up, just like that. What? Boom. All right, let's see what we got here. All right, you guys, there's our haul for the day, our Easter Sunday treasure. So it looks like we got, what, eight, nine, ten of these rings. Um, handful of pennies. What is that? Seven pennies at least. A few pull tabs. You got the zipper pull. You got the erasers and the pencils. You got this piece of aluminum. Some vintage can. You got this bullet casing that I can't really read it. Looks like L242 something something. I don't know. Mower hit it. We got two quarters, five dimes, two nickels, and hitting the cycle at least twice. We got this little ring. Getting the sun a little bit. Little blinger with some tiny little stones in it. Definitely, definitely not real. But it is a ring. A wise man once said, a ring is a ring is a ring is a ring. And we did get our wheat penny. 1944. Can't really see the mint mark. If there is one, I don't know. But yeah. Two Wheaties. I mean, one Wheatie. My last hunt, I got a Wheatie. Was that my last hunt? I don't think it was. I don't know. I don't even put my videos in order, so maybe it was the last video you saw. Anyway, we got a ring and a weedy. Oh, boy. All right, you guys. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today. I had a fun little hunt. Hope everyone had a happy Easter. Looks like spring has sprung and we have better weather ahead. So hopefully we'll be able to get out more and uh, find some more treasure. As always, guys, stay up, stay blessed, and we will see y'all on the next one. Peace.